fast, 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 accurate. You're watching WSBT 22 News at 11. Good evening, I'm Caroline Torrey. One of the first black mayors for a big U.S. city has died. Former Gary Mayor Richard Hatcher has passed away. He was 86 years old. Hatcher died Friday night in a Chicago hospital surrounded by his loved ones. No cause of death was provided. Hatcher was elected in 1967, when at the time, Gary was the second largest city in Indiana. Hatcher would go on to serve five terms before leaving office in 1987. And we have new information on breaking news we first brought you last night. The driver of a fatal car accident in Marshall County has been identified. The driver was 40-year-old Shelby Gaines from the Tyner area in Marshall County. An initial investigation into the crash shows that Gaines may have been texting and driving before she crashed on Plymouth LaPorte Trail. She was also probably not wearing a seatbelt as she was thrown from the car. The crash is still under investigation. And police are still trying to find out more information about last week's shooting at a naval shipyard in Pearl Harbor. Three people died, including the gunman. Now officials say that there is still no motive for why the gunman acted. A message sent by the shipyard commander captain says that the shooter was not facing any non-judicial punishment. According to the captain, the shooter had not been scheduled for any anger management or stress management classes. And new at 11, police divers in New Zealand are looking for the bodies of the victims from the White Island volcanic eruption. Police are searching for the last two victims of that eruption that left at least 16 people dead and dozens severely burned. Six more bodies were recovered Friday in a risky four-hour operation requiring hazmat suits. They believe that one body is in the water around the island. The location of the other body is unknown. New Zealand Deputy Police Commissioner Mike Clement said authorities are hopefully and crews will be able to return to the island Sunday and continue the search for those missing people. We know that time is of the essence.